Freaking hot. Crazy hot. Boiling. Nearly two-thirds of all Americans were under heat warnings this week as a historic heat dome pushed much of the southeast to heat indices over 110 degrees. And it's not just the U.S. Turkey, Japan, Oman, Iraq, Borneo all endured their highest temperatures ever and July heat records were smashed throughout Europe and Australia. How did it get so hot? Here's what the news isn't telling you. All weather comes from the sun's heat interacting with land, water, and air. Today, there's more heat trapped on Earth than at any time in modern human history because of pollution from burning oil, gas, and coal. So we're experiencing more extreme weather than at any time in the history of human civilization. The more fossil fuel pollution, the higher the temperature. The more dangerous the weather. This is 100% for sure cold, hard, irrefutable scientific truth. And the fossil fuel industry has known it since the 50s and 60s. There was a lot they could have done even back then. Electric vehicles, solar panels, and batteries, they were all invented back in the 1800s. The sun gives us 10,000 times more energy than we use. But instead of fixing the problem, the fossil fuel industry hid the truth. They spent billions promoting the lies that the science was unsettled, that we had nothing to worry about, and that weather is just weather. But scientific evidence remains inconclusive as to whether human activities affect the global climate. And they co-opted media and government to help them keep selling oil, gas, and coal, to keep polluting. Because of the fossil fuel industry's continued influence, their pollution is at an all-time high. The Earth's temperature is rising faster than at any time in human history. And most people don't realize the danger we're facing and that it is still growing. Thanks to heat trapping carbon pollution, the baseline temperature is rising. That means we're seeing more heat, both during the day and at night. The average number of heat waves U.S. cities experience each year has doubled since the 1980s. Warmer air is more humid, which makes the heat not only more uncomfortable, but more dangerous. Last year, 2,400 people died from heat more than double compared to just 2020. These disasters are what scientists warned the fossil fuel industry about 70 years ago. They knew it would happen. They hit it. And now it's happening. This isn't just weather. It's not natural. It was done to us. Be aware and be safe.